Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Ocarina of Time. In the last part, we defeated the Dead Hand and got ourselves the Lens of Truth. And in this part, we are going to be going to this terrible place to find the Gold Flotillas hidden within. Get rid of him. And go back and head through this hole. You have a heart. And it's only missing a quarter, but still, might as well get it back. Okay, in order to get to the gold flotillas, you have to find the keys hidden in this dungeon. Which means we have some exploring to do. Joy. Okay. First thing you'll notice that there's actually a visible wall here. At least to this room. And a visible hole under this X. Oh yeah, trick with the lens of truth. If you don't want to consume magic power while you're using it. I'm gonna kill this guy first. Okay, if you tap the button repeatedly, and while it does make kind of annoying noise, you won't use magic power. So just a trick to keep in mind. It... Nabby, now you warn me. Now you warn me. Good grief, Nabby. Okay, believe it or not, we actually kind of want to fall down this hole, so... And we land on this nice little platform with rupees. And... Oh, that's... that's lovely. Hand sticking out of the water. Okay, pretty much the only passage you're gonna want to go through. This one with these torches here. So, pull out our bombs. And... We have a redead. Not dealing with you. Well, I am, but not without doing this. There we go. And you can die now. Ew. Go ahead and open this chest. And that's pretty much the only thing worth coming for down here. If you even call that worth it. In order to get it out, we have to collect all these silver rupees. And you also have to do this every time you fall down. This is where you end up. Which is kind of a pain. So we're gonna, so we're gonna try not to fall. At least not a lot. And I don't get how climbing up that ladder took off my bunny hood yet. Climbing up this ladder did not. At least it didn't seem to. No. Well, then it did. Never mind. Let's just get out of here. Okay, we're back here. Another invisible wall. And the only drawback with using lunch truce like this is you have to listen to that noise, but. Ah, we actually have a little chest here. And we got our first key. Nice. Okay. If you head through here, and you look in this cage, you see another chest. But wait, there's a hole. So we actually, of course that thing came back, in order to get the come, well, the chest. You have to go around here, and open it from this side. And there's our compass. Okay. The next thing I want to do is... Avoid that. Oh. And then there's actually a visible wall there. Didn't even know it. Okay. I believe that thing says danger above. Yeah, uh huh. Yeah. It's referring to a skull tool that's up there. We're just gonna avoid that. And head this way. 
back to our danger below sign. So you can see it's pointing out the hole that's right there. And you. <sighs> pointing out the hole that's right there. So if we avoid that, we can go through here. We have a locked door, so let's go ahead and open it. We're coming to this really weird room with holes everywhere. So. Gonna go ahead and pull out our slingshot, and you may want to equip the Hylian shield just in case. Since these are fire keys. Oh, come on. Where's the last one? I thought you'd do that. Die. Okay, we have a BMO, so... Let's go ahead and throw a bomb over here. Okay, avoid these holes. Blue rupee there. I believe that will contain a Deku shield if yours gets burned up. Go through here. And a skull plus. Oh crap! Yes, this actually puts you right in the cage with the like like. It's very likely he will eat you. Unless you're just very skilled. Please die. Because unfortunately we don't have our arrows, so... And he's gone. Thank goodness. Okay. Let's see what's in here. Yay, blue ruby. But the real prize is that Skultla. And dead. Okay, there we go. Now we get out the same way we came in. And the fire keys and the females are back, of course. Die. Die. Okay, I'm actually just going to try to avoid the demos. I don't feel like killing it again. <sighs> Crawl back through. Okay. Next, I'm gonna look for that other another key that's in an alcove somewhere. Not there, but here. Here we go. Okay, there's just one more key we need to find. Stupid thing. <sighs> okay. I just have to remember where it is. But it looks like we're about out of time anyway, so I will try to figure out where that is in the next part. So, next time I'm Ocarina of Time, we will hopefully finish getting the skull to us in this terrible place. See you guys then.